All right, the news that's just coming in is that Malaysian low budget airline Air Asia has sought the government's nod to launch an uh, airline with the Tatars in India. Air Asia will hold a 49% stake in the joint venture, the third partner uh, uh, being Telestra Trade Place. Air Asia says it will operate from Chennai to domestic destinations. In a statement, Air Asia said the environment is suitable to operate a low cost airline in India. Karma Paljor, uh, our business editor, with us for more on uh, this. Uh, Karma, what does this uh, mean in, in the current aviation space in India? Uh, Ananya, it's certainly significant because uh, the Tata name coming in, Tata's coming back into uh, aviation again, once again, that's certainly big. Remember, they used to run Air India some time ago. They are bid to take over Air India later in a joint venture with Singapore Airlines also did not work out. So, Tata Sons getting into aviation space once again is very significant because uh, they always work on a long-term basis and the vision they'll have for the aviation sector and the way they are getting into this is very very interesting number two advantage for passengers is that air asia is a, a low cost low cost airline it's one of the biggest in terms of fleet size in southeast asia so what they are able to do is connect passengers uh, they had a long haul flight uh, to some of the cities air asia x used to operate but they pulled it out in 2012 because uh, they could not really find the load from india air asia express does operate to some of the cities in india like uh, kolkata so significantly i think they want to increase connectivity because the statement really says uh, regional uh, airline is what they are looking at based out of chennai they'll be looking at connecting south indian cities and i suppose flying them out uh, to their destination kuala lumpur right from there there onwards connecting outwards all right so better connectivity within india better connectivity with south asian destinations uh, would it also mean uh, competitive fares would it mean that fares goes go down Definitely, Ananya, as I said earlier, Air Asia is a very competitive airline. Uh, they have got a, a, a worldwide network from Kuala Lumpur. The airline's, of course, headquartered in Kuala Lumpur. It's got an interesting, very interesting uh, uh, a business model, the airline run by Tony Fernandez, who is uh, of an Indian origin. So that will be interesting to watch because sometime back, about uh, three, four years back, I had... Uh, spoken to Tony Fernandez uh, when he was launching Air Asia and operating it in from Kuala Lumpur and that time he had said that yes I'm in, in I'm interested in India this is not the right time perhaps the right time has come now